Hey everyone, uh, finally made it back to a live video this week and uh, I want to talk about rest a little bit. So I, just, I got up this morning about 7.15 and uh, laid around for a little while and drove down to New Orleans for CSM Combined Sections meeting for physical therapy uh, for the whole American Physical Therapy Association and uh, <laughs> drove from the big mountains of North Louisiana down here. It took me about six hours, but I um, just want to talk about rest a little bit. So this has been one of the longest weeks I've had in a long time. Uh, I work till about 12 or 12.30 every night for the last three weeks and doing uh, stuff for the business. We switched to EMRs. I'm doing my own billing now, uh, editing my podcast, making videos, just all the stuff that I do um, that drives Monica crazy, I'm sure. But got all that stuff done and then um, just really started feeling bad Monday night. And Tuesday, wasn't able to go to work, just exhausted and, and just feeling bad and you know, haven't been on here. So one of my patients that I saw yesterday in the clinic said something about her mom. She said, Hey mom, um, you know, you've, you've had a stroke, you've had a heart attack, you've had some other things going on in the last few years. And now you're just taking care of everybody. And maybe you need to sit down and rest for a little while. And she was like, you know, of course we know how moms are. They're like, no, nah, we're not doing that. We're going to keep serving everybody and doing what we want to do. But it got me to thinking like how many of you, including myself, how many of us just stop and rest? Probably not very many of us. And so, you know, I basically ran myself into the ground last week or this week by not resting for the last three. And it was something that could have easily been avoided. Um, you know, I could get things done at other times and things like that, but, but I just I kept trying to push through it. And so I know all of us do that too, but, but the point is, is I can't be myself, I can't be 100% when I'm doing that. And so, I need to rest sometimes. And so basically, you know, here I am, I'm going to get, I'm going to work this weekend, but I'm going to be recharged. When I get back to Vivian on Monday, I'm going to be, you know, ready to go. And, and this is just such an uplifting event for me. And um, we got a meeting with about 12 other PTs on Saturday and Sunday. And we're just going to be talking about business and growing and all that cool stuff. Avery, what's up, man? I wish you were here. And, um, and just all this cool stuff, but I'm refreshed. I mean, look, I, I look refreshed. I feel great right now. I'm in a good mood. I'm smiling. And it's going to be like that the whole weekend. But the point is, I didn't work till 1230 every night this week. I stopped. I let myself rest and kind of get rejuvenated. And that's what I needed. And so I'm just going to call you back, Randall. I promise. <laughs> um, I know you'll be here. We'll see you in a couple, few, few months, Avery. But I, I let myself rest. And so I feel good now. I'm not, I'm not irritable, and um, I can get things done. I can be productive. So please, 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 please take time to rest. Your family will appreciate you more. Um, if you just need to take a day off, not take a day off, but just you know, take a few minutes off and, and just get by yourself and, and just be quiet or whatever. I drove down here today, and at the, uh, at the um, urging of somebody, I didn't listen to a podcast. I listened, didn't listen to any books. I didn't try to learn anything. I just listened to worship and praise music the whole way down here. And I had a smile on my face when I got here. And I think if I would have done what I usually do, I'd have still been just tired and exhausted. So I uh, hope you guys get some rest. And uh, there's going to be a ton of live videos this weekend. So you might want to hide me, but, but don't hide me because I'll be talking about cool stuff. So y'all have a great weekend and uh, love you guys.